Hey guys, what's going on? It's Vikal23, back with another video, and today we got some more brand new content for July 4th, and it is the second set of Home Run Derby cards. Now, I haven't talked about the first set yet since I was waiting for the entire thing to be out, but there are a ton of brand new cards right now, um, 13 in total in this set. There are six high tier cards and six low tier cards. You can see them all right here. You have Luis Gonzalez, Dave Parker, Tino Martinez, Todd Frazier, Jason Giambi, Garrett Anderson, Aaron Judge, Cal Ripken, Pete Alonso, Yohan Cespedes, Robinson Cano, Giancarlo Stanton, and the Collection Award, Ken Griffey Jr. Each of the low tier cards are going for about 6k right now, so they're just about at quick sell value. So if you want to pick any of these cards up, it's really not that expensive. The packs just dropped today, so if you're interested in any of these cards, it's definitely worth picking up. The higher tier cards are about from 60k to 65k. They actually went up in price. Yesterday they were about at 50k, so they did go up. Would not recommend buying them unless you want the Griffey. And honestly, guys, if you want my recommendation, it's actually to not go after this Ken Griffey Jr. card. You can look at him and you see the 125 power, but that's about it with this card. The vision isn't there and the contact isn't there. And that's that's an issue because contact makes that PCI size. And with that contact, it's going to be pretty small. So I don't I don't think he takes out Mansell. I don't think he takes out Sheffield or Reggie or um, Larry Walker. Like whoever you have, I don't think he takes out. And that's the issue since you're spending like about a, a couple hundred thousand stubs to get this card. Um, unless you're like, you know, you have all the stubs in the world, then yes, it's, it's fine. Go for it. Um, especially since a lot of these cards can be bench bats. And uh, in my opinion, the best card in the set is just Robinson Cano, you know, second baseman. He absolutely kills the ball, and he might, might, might make your starting lineup. Honestly, he really can um, over Rhino if um, he's the kind of guy you like. Especially if you need a lefty in your lineup, he'll be the move. You also get ten show packs for just locking in three. So that's just like if you can find three guys that you think you could actually use, even if they're just lower tier cards, you get ten free packs. So it's not even that bad, but. This collection is definitely not the one I'd recommend doing. Like, if you if you want to save your stubs, save them. Um, I mean, I don't even have the stubs to do it if I wanted to. But, um, yeah, guys, that's just my thoughts on this uh, Home Run Derby stuff. I mean, the packs themselves are selling for around 20 k So it's not a bad idea to actually buy these packs if you're into, you know, these risk-reward type things. Because, you know, you can make a decent amount of stubs off of it. Um, especially if you're planning on doing the collection. Just, you know, risk-reward. You can see what you can get. Um, you know, because you're going to need the lower tier cards anyway. So if you get the low round, you can at least pick someone. But, um, yeah, I, I'm not going to buy either. Just not interested in those, in those. But, um, yeah, that is the new collection award, guys. I just wanted to talk about it quickly with you. Just give you my thoughts. And, uh, yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys are doing in the comments. Who you're going after. If you're going to do it. And, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.